The bill that would criminalize certain drag shows passed the Tennessee Senate today, leaving it up to the House to decide its fate. State Capitol reporter Chris O'Brien and photojournalist Joe Gregory were there when the vote happened. They take us inside. Eyes 26, six nays. Senate Bill 3, having received a constitutional majority, is, is adopted. Thursday morning, a bill to potentially criminalize certain drag shows took another major step to becoming law as it passed the Senate on a party-line vote. It didn't go without argument, though. This law applies everywhere in our state and puts citizens in a place of calling the police, calling prosecutors anytime they think somebody isn't raising their kids right. Republicans contend the bill is about protecting children, not an attack on the LGBTQ community. And for somebody to make it an attack on a certain group of people is not what it's about. The bill would outlaw any performance law enforcement deems prurient. Are they doing something that is defined in our statute as harmful to a minor? Are they doing something that involves nudity, sexual excitement, sexual conduct, excess violence, or sadomasochistic mas masochistic abuse. But Democrats say it's an inefficient plan as federal law already outlaws obscenity. Plus, they argue it enables violent behavior. Apparent and obscene behavior is already covered under federal law. I'm sure that most of us also saw the self-proclaimed Nazis who were protesting drag shows. Is that who we want to align ourselves with? Still, the bill passed easily as Republicans hold a 27 to 6 supermajority in the Senate. The bill now rests in the House, where it's widely expected to pass easily there, too. In Nashville, Chris O'Brien. This bill will also require Governor Bill Lee's signature. He's previously indicated he supports the bill and will likely sign it.